police just moments ago saying for the first time they did not buckle him in. Freddie Gray, who was arrested and when it was all over, had a nearly severed spine. Of course, that video showing the moment he was dragged by police, then put into a police van. They put him in leg irons and then traveled through the city to other police calls. The police commissioner acknowledging not putting a seatbelt on him was a violation and that he should have had medical attention much sooner. The mayor of Baltimore tonight calling the police handling of the situation, quote, absolutely unacceptable. ABC's David Wright leads us off from Baltimore. Tonight in Baltimore, police on the defensive at a loss to explain how 25-year-old Freddie Gray was put into a police wagon walking, talking, and breathing. But by the time the van got to the station, he had serious injuries. Gray died a week later. What happened is now the focus of a major investigation. Tonight, police confirm the arresting officers did not follow procedures. We know he was not buckled in the transportation wagon, as he should have been. No excuses for that, period. Police now say the van made several stops en route to the station. At one point, officers had to pick Gray up off the floor to put him back into his seat. At no point did he have a seatbelt on? At no point did he have a seatbelt on. Tonight, police admitted he should have received medical attention much sooner. This is absolutely unacceptable, and I want answers. The incident has touched off a week of protests, including some violent scuffles. Protesters claim Gray was the victim of what's known in Baltimore as a rough ride. Police intentionally stopping short and driving erratically with the intention of causing injuries. And the city has settled other cases. Late today, police released this new image, hoping the public can help identify these individuals, witnesses to the arrest. This is the police station that's been the focus of many of the protests tonight, cordoned off in expectation of more. On Monday, Freddie Gray will be buried. This community demanding answers. David? David Wright tonight. David, thank you.